So in this presentation, we're going to talk about what types of crooked teeth or what we call malocclusions are there. Everybody wants a straighter smile. It's really incredible what kind of changes are possible these days with modern technology. You can see here a few different solutions that we've provided and you can see how long it took. So some of the cases took four months and some of them can take up to 11 months. Depends on how severe it is, but that's a long distance away from two to three years worth of treatment. Crooked teeth get worse. Teeth move throughout life. If you look at our straight teeth guide video, I explain in more information, but you can see having crooked teeth can lead to other dental problems. When we examine it, we look at different views. We look at side views, we look at your front smile, and we evaluate what issues there are. Having the crooked teeth here, you can see that the lower teeth are chipping, the front teeth are chipping, and then also gum disease can start on the lower teeth where you can't clean between them. As I said, teeth move over time. If we're looking here, when someone's 20 years old, their bottom front tooth might be in a little bit, and then as it goes on, their bottom front tooth can push forward and the gum can recede. The gums can get swollen because you can't clean properly and that can lead to gum disease and eventually teeth becoming loose, bad breath and tooth loss. Crooked teeth can also cause other problems. If we're looking at the healthy tooth at the top left hand side, we've got nice pointy edges. If the teeth are not meeting in the right way, the edges can get worn down. You can see here that the edge is wearing down. If the tooth is getting knocked at a funny angle, you can see that the gum can start to weaken around the tooth, leading to gum disease around the tooth. This means that when we do a little measurement around the gum, you can see what we call gingivitis. This is a gum infection, or it can get worse, leading to advanced chronic periodontitis, which is gum disease. What this means is that your breath doesn't feel fresh and also your teeth can become loose. So what kinds of crowding or malocclusions do we have? You can have crowding, which is really not enough space for the teeth. And this is essentially the bite is kind of in the right place, but the front teeth, they're just not fitting properly. We can have a deep bite. This is where the upper teeth move over the lower teeth too much, and it causes the lower teeth to wear down and the upper teeth to wear down as well. We can have spacing. This is where we have gaps between the teeth. Quite visually obvious. This could be caused by the jaw being too big, the teeth being too small, or a